about 50% of young steelhead trying to navigate their way through the Hood Canal Bridge die here every year. Now, a new piece of equipment installed today hopes to alleviate that. The Hood Canal Bridge is a floating bridge. You'd think fish would have no problem swimming under it, but a lot of them do, especially right here. And they realized that steelhead were um, going missing and presumed dying near the bridge. NOAA scientists say this corner of the bridge acts as a barrier, which tends to trap fish, making them an easy meal for seals. And so when they encounter the bridge, it's like a, a large wall to them. And so they're going either way, trying to figure out how to get around the bridge. Um, and in the process of kind of milling about trying to figure out how to get around the bridge, they were getting picked off by seals. This big yellow triangle is a $1.6 million fish guidance structure called a fillet. It essentially blocks the corner off, keeping the fish from getting stuck. Shara Ainsley is with Long Live the Kings, a nonprofit salmon and steelhead recovery organization. She explains how the system will work. And it will create a flat surface to guide fish around that corner so they won't get lost and confused. It'll prevent seals, hopefully, from being able to use that corner to corral them. Researchers will tag the fish and use an underwater camera to observe them during migration season to determine whether traveling under the bridge is safer for fish. And hopefully what we'll see is that when it's in place, we see higher survival, we see less predation by seals. If researchers determine that the fillet is actually working here, they plan to install three others on the three other corners of the Hood Canal Bridge. On Hood Canal, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.